So this is my aunt and uncle's microwave from the 1980s, and this thing is just an absolute beast. It's been running strong since then. The only problem it's ever had was that the uh, the button to open the door, that exterior part of the button, fell off like sometime in the mid 90s. Um, I don't know, maybe I should 3D print a replacement. That'd be fun. But anyways, other other than that, this thing is just a rock solid beast. But it it has some interesting controls to it, and that's what I wanted to go over today. So. First, I'm gonna put this in here. I'm gonna take out the spoon because I'm not gonna microwave the spoon, although this also is a convection oven, so I could have the spoon in there if I had it on convection oven mode. I just don't build these things like they used to. Anyways, so instead of having your, you know, 10 point keypad where you have one through nine and then zero, you just have, you know, little spread out of 10, one, 10, one. So the first thing we gotta do with this guy we're going to go ahead and we're going to set the power. So I'm going to put it on medium. I got medium right there. And then I'm going to go ahead and put it for one minute and 50 seconds. And then hit start. But yeah, I don't know. This is this is what uh, the controls for most microwaves in the 80s looked like. And you know, this thing, it's kind of goofy, but... Again, it's an absolute beast. This thing's been used almost daily since, I don't know, like 1987 or whatever. It's older than me. And just keeps on trucking. I just don't quite build them like they used to, do they?